all so much. Our name is Golden Oak. We're from Portland, Maine. We're so happy to be here in Lake Orion. This is such a cute town you guys have. <laughs> um, we actually, we, we were here uh, last fall and we played inside 20 Front Street. And so it's really nice to see what it's like, you know, in the summertime and get the summer vibes too. So yes. Thank you guys for joining us and coming out to this. Also, that playground looks really fun. Really fun. <laughs> it does. That was like the first thing we all said when we got here. We were like, whoa, check out that playground. That's pretty fun. Thank you. 
We're right. All these mirrors pointing at me. I've come to witness the things I can't see. I've come to witness the passing of the time. Thank you all again. Thank you so much. It's really great to be here. We've been on the road now for, what, about a week? Has it been a week? No, maybe not quite. Close I don't know. It's it. so funny. After like two days, I'm like, I no it's idea. In the lifetime. Yeah. No. <laughs> Just live on the road now. Yeah. No, it's, I think it's been about a week. It's been a really lovely tour. Um, we got to spend some, started in sort of upstate New York and then made our way to Cincinnati, over to Chicago, and then a couple dates in Illinois. And then we, we often take Monday and Tuesdays off, you know, kind of slow days for, for musicians. Um, and uh, we were lucky enough to find a really lovely uh, campsite here in Michigan and spent like two nights over at Yankee Springs Recreational Area. Anybody know it? Hey, it's fun. It's fun. <laughs> yeah. it like one person, like, yeah, I heard it. <laughs> no, yeah, it was a, it was really beautiful. It was over outside of Kalamazoo, um, where we got to go to Bell's Brewing. I'm sure people have heard of Bell's. Very, mm -hmm. very popular from what we've heard. Like everybody and their brother was like, if you're going to Mission, go to Bell's Brewing. We're like, all right, we'll just camp near it, <laughs> so we can just uh, knock that off the list. So that's what we did. We camped and we swam and we drank beer at Bell's Brewing. But it was it was a lovely Monday Tuesday off here in Michigan. It was really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you guys have a beautiful state. Actually, in a lot of ways, it, it kind of reminds us a lot of Maine. I feel like there's a lot of similar, similar vibes happening. Maine to Michigan. Yeah, no, that's true. No mountains. We have the mountains, but you guys have lakes that are about 8,000 times bigger than ours, <laughs> so you win on that front.
school or middle school bandies out there yeah be proud be yeah, proud raise your hands be proud yeah, come about on. That. look what you can do <laughs> yes for all those uh, middle school clarinet players who have a dream it's possible you know <laughs> it's not just symphonies <laughs> you can be in a folk band it's really random folk <laughs> bands too <laughs> you can convince your brother to let you play it in the band it's cool <laughs> Falling 
Thank you guys. Um, I was thinking about something in the middle of that song, other than singing the song, um, which was, so I, I mentioned earlier we had played uh, 20 Front Street in the fall. Um, we did this like big West Coast tour last October where we um, played shows all the way from Maine out to New Mexico and Colorado and back. And when we got home and we were reflecting on our tour, um, every single one of us said that our favorite show that we played on the entire tour was Lake Orion. <laughs> Yeah. True. <laughs> There's something very special here. Like I don't, I don't know. It's something going on. You guys got it. <laughs> it's in the water. <laughs> yeah, it's, it might be in the water. I don't know. <laughs>
Thank you, Greg. Oh, thank you so much. So about a year ago, just over a year ago, we came out with our, our latest record, um, which is an album called Room to Grow. Um, and it's a, it's a 10 song uh, reflection about the emotional and physical impacts of the climate crisis, which is something that was kind of stuck in the back of our minds when we sat down to work on this new record and we decided to lean into it and, and, uh, and dedicate the record to it. Um, we're gonna play you guys another song from that release. Uh, this is a song called Falter.
Thank you all. Thank you all so much. next tune we're gonna play for you guys this is a song that I wrote um, a few years ago after spending some time out in Montana and at the time I was uh, playing lots of music and meeting all these incredible people um, and when it was time for me to come home instead of hopping on a plane I decided to take a train ride across the country so I, I got on a train in Whitefish Montana and I rode this train for three days um, all the way from Montana across the entire country to Boston. Um, and at the time I was a college student, so in other words, I was really poor. So I couldn't afford like a fancy sleeper car that they have on trains. So instead I thought that I would be very capable of just falling asleep in my train seat um, for three nights. So that did not happen. Didn't really sleep at all, but instead, I met a lot of interesting people on the train and I wrote this song. So it's called Montana. <laughs> Steering. 
And there's probably a pile of you that are seeing us for the first time tonight. Give a big yell if you're seeing us for the first time tonight, yeah? That's awesome. That's fantastic. We'd like to say we hope if it's your first time, it's not your last time. That's, that's our first thing. The second thing is we'd like to let you know that uh, Lita and I are actually brother and sister. Yes, yes. Thank you. We worked really hard to become brother and sister, so we appreciate the support on that. Yes, but like most importantly, we just look like we have to, this is like our PSA at every Golden Oak show for the new people. We're like, just so you know, we're brother and sister and we're not a couple. So that's that. We Get know the, there are the some way. of you out there that are like, wow, what a cute little folk couple we have here in the Corian today. Yeah, and we're like, that's gross. So. Yes, um, that's gross. <laughs> Anybody else here with their sibling? Must oh, be some yeah. playground kids here with yeah. siblings, right? Here with your brother or your sister. This show is yeah. for all the siblings on the playground. <laughs> or not on the playground, we're here. Or not on the playground, that's true. <laughs> that's awesome. Some siblings over there, that's fantastic. Yeah. Love to hear that. Could you imagine getting in a van with each other and just driving across the country for a living? Yeah. <laughs> yes. We love each other very much. Mm -hmm. We do. <laughs>
thank you guys. How beautiful of a night is this? This is just like a fantastic late July night, you know? It's like one of those ones where you think there might be thunderstorms. It says it early in the day, and then it just clears out. The sky opens up. You get a beautiful evening. It's, it's a really, really beautiful night. Thanks for being a part of it with us. Yeah, we're very, very happy to be here. So uh, now that we got you guys all like jacked up, we're gonna bring it back down a little bit for this next tune. Um, this next song is a song about um, invasive beetles, uh, which like, you know, a lot of bands will write like love songs or breakup songs, but like we tend to write songs about invasive beetles. Um, so yeah. <laughs> Do you want to elaborate on that? <laughs> I feel like no. <laughs> this is a tune that um, we actually, we were lucky enough to just put out a music video for it. And it's a song that's about the emerald ash borer, which is uh, an invasive beetle that affects ash trees in Maine, and I believe here in, in Michigan as well. Um, and it's, it's, you know, it's a beetle that they've just found in Maine and, and our, you know, there's all this important work being done to try to save ash trees before it infects um, all these beautiful trees. And we had the opportunity um, to, to uh, make a music video for this song with um, a dear friend of ours who uh, is a Passamaquoddy indigenous um, uh, to Maine, to the East Coast, um, uh, who is an ash basket maker. And, we, uh, we did this, this project with him, filming him all the way from uh, sort of tree to basket and what that process means physically, but also what that process means emotionally, right? This is something that um, has been passed down through uh, uh, his people since the beginning of time. Um, and so, yeah, if, if you guys enjoy the song, you can check out the video on YouTube. It's, it's, uh, it's really great. Um, and uh, this song's called Ash. And you can also check out his work. His name's Gabriel Frey. Um, he makes the most beautiful baskets I've ever seen. So.
So this is, um, this is kind of our turning around point in this tour. We start making our way back, um, back to the East Coast, back to Maine to catch some of Maine in the summer, which we've missed. As I'm sure you guys know, summers are precious when places you have winter. <laughs> so it's nice to kind of catch as much of them as you can. So we'll scoot home and we got a whopping four days at home <laughs> <laughs> before we take back off. Um, but yeah, so tomorrow we head down to Columbus, Ohio, and then a big drive all the way over to Syracuse, New York, and then another big drive over to Portsmouth, New Hampshire. And then we're just about an hour from home. We'll sleep in our own beds on Saturday night, which sounds amazing. Sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty good. Well, actually, you're going to probably be on my floor. That's true. I'm going to be on your floor. <laughs> yeah. But I'll be in my own bed Saturday My bed's night. a little further north. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know. Floor, you know, your floor starts to feel like home, oh, I guess, yeah, at, uh, right. at a certain point. <laughs> but it's been a really, really, really lovely stretch of dates. And um, this has obviously been no exception. It's been so wonderful being here with you all. Um, we're going to play you guys the, the title track from the record we've been talking about. Um, as I mentioned, it came out about a year ago, and it took us a while to name um, the album. Um, but we decided to name it after this song, and I think we, we chose this song just because of how personal this one was to us. Um, is a song called Room to Grow.
So um, we're going to switch it up on you guys for this next one, and we're going to put our instruments down, and we're going to sing a little a cappella tune for you. Um, so this is a just like one of those old traditional folk tunes. I learned this um, from some of my girlfriends back in the day and used to sing it with them. And um, one day I was brave enough to bring it to the boys here. And I was like, okay guys, usually I sing this like with two women, but we'll see how you do. Um, you know what, they nailed it. They nailed it. So yeah, they, they did me very proud. Um, this is a song called Turtle Dove. Well, turtle dovey don't droop his wings. Turtle dovey don't droop his wings. His wings. His wings. Wing. Turtle dovey don't droop his wings. High on Zion's hills, Adam and Eve don't. Adam and Eve won't you tell it. To me, meet me at the door, won't you tell it to me, Sassalas, don't, so I see. Well, my name is written on day, this line. My name is written on day, this Don't you tell it to me, Sasa, Sasa, don't so I see. When I go to heaven, I know the rules. I know the rules. When I go to heaven, I know the rules. The rules. The rules. The rules. When I go to heaven, I know the rules. Don't skip on down to the heat. So I see. Well, turtle dove, it done drew his wings. Don't his wings. Turtle dove, it done drew his wings. His wings. His wings. His wings. Turtle dove, it done drew his wings. High on Zion's hill, the same. Tell it to me, meet me at the door. Won't you tell it to me, Sasa's door? So I see. Thank you, Mike. That's Mike Knowles on the vocals and bass, everybody. Hey, and this is uh, Jackson Cromwell back here on the drums. <laughs> This is my wonderful sister, Lena Kendall, everyone. And this is Zach Kendall, everybody. We are Golden Oak. We've got a couple more tunes for you guys. It's been really nice. Thank you for that.
folks these days sure are plenty. But now that I am, feel the wind like you and I do. Chasing dreams, saving streams, a drink or two. Hope that these words find you well. When I see you again, cannot tell. Give a lot of love to the world, my friend. Now do the same on my Thank you, Adam. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so very much. It has been really, really, really wonderful to be here hanging out with you all tonight. It's, you know, we're a long way from home, and um, it's, uh, it's, it's sometimes not easy to be this far away from home, but when you come into a beautiful place like Lake Orion, and there's all these wonderful people like each and every one of you to greet us, it makes what we do so special and so worth it to us. So thank you so much for being here. Let's give a round of applause to the great people who put on this, this fantastic free concert series. How special is that? To the group. And for making us sound good out there. Yeah. <laughs> That's Jim, everybody, doing the sound for us. Thank you, Jim. And like we mentioned probably a bunch of times, but our name is Golden Oak. You can find our music on Spotify and Apple Music and YouTube and wherever you listen to music. Um, so give us a follow and add us to your playlists. And yeah, we're just we're just so happy to be here. We'd also love to, to talk with each of you after the show. We've got a little merch table over here. We've got CDs, vinyl records. It's really, really soft t-shirts. <laughs> like not those full cotton shrink in the wash kind of t-shirts, some nice soft t-shirts kind of want to like live your life in. Mm -hmm. Mike doesn't take his off except for shows, I'm serious. <laughs> so come say hello at the merch table, we'd, we'd love to talk with you guys after the show. We've got an email list too, you can sign up and you'll know exactly the next time that we're, we're here in Lake Orion. Because we'd love to come back, is that all right? Yeah! Yeah, cool. Thank you. If you know this next one, feel free to get up and dance, feel free to sing along, feel free to sit and enjoy whatever feels right to you. We love you guys.
Thank you all so much. Our name is Golden Oak. We hope you have a fantastic evening.